Hello everyone, today we're exploring PBR in Second Life. PBR, or physically based rendering, simulates realistic light interactions. Let's start with finding free PBR textures. We'll use AmbientCG at AmbientCG.com. They offer over 2.200 free assets. Remember to respect licenses and share sources. When downloading, choose 1K or 2K textures. Second Life supports up to 2040x2048. Avoid 4K or 8K textures, they're too large for Second Life. Next, we'll prepare textures using GLTF Packer. Download it from the official site and run the application. Match downloaded maps to correct slots, base color, occlusion, roughness, metallic and normal. Click Save to create the GLTF file. Now let's upload to Second Life. Go to Build, select Upload then Material. Choose your GLTF file and verify all slots are filled. Click Save to upload. Cost 10 linden per slot for 1K textures, 40 linden for 2K. Free with Premium Plus. To apply, create or select an object. Change textures to PBR Metallic Roughness. Drag the material from inventory or select from the menu. To modify, select the object and click Edit Selected. You can adjust tin, transparency, metallic and roughness factors. To remove PBR, select the object, click None in Texture Selector. Change back to Textures from PBR Metallic Roughness. That's it! Experiment with PBR for stunning results in Second Life. Thanks for watching. Any questions? Ask in the comments.